God. You are my God. I keep looking for you. I do thirst for you. And you faint with longing for you in a dry parched land where there is no water. So I've looked upon you in the holy place. I've seen your strength and your glory because your glory and love is greater than life. My own lips will glorify you. Thus I'll praise you all my life. In your name, I will lift up my hands. I am satisfied with the best and choicest portions. So my mouth will praise you with joy on my lips. And remember you well upon my bed. I meditate on you during the watches of the night. For you are my helper. And I shout joyfully in the shadow of your wings. I cling to you. Your right hand keeps fast hold on me. But those who seek to destroy my life will sent into the depths of the earth. They will be handed over to the power of the sword. So they will become food for jackals. But the king will rejoice in God. A prince, person slain by him will exult. For the mouth of those speaking lies will be silent. Hear my voice, O God, as I plead. Safeguard my life from the dreadfulness of the enemy. Shield me from the secret plots of wicked men, from a crowd of wrongdoers. They sharpen the tongue just like a sword. They end the cool woods like arrows to shoot at the ends of her hiding places. They shield him suddenly without fear. The hope fast to the aim and intent. They discuss how to hide their traps. They say, who will see them? They search out new ways of wrongdoing. They secretly devise their shrewd strategies. The thinking within each one's heart is unfathomable. But God will shoot at them. Suddenly they will be wounded by an arrow. Their own tongue will cause their downfall. All those looking on will shake their heads. And all men will become afraid. And they will proclaim what God has done and they'll have insight into his deeds. The righteous one will rejoice in Jehovah and take refuge in him. All the upright in heart will exult. 